The suspension of the Indonesian Super League is hitting club finances, including those of Persebaya Surabaya, whose inclusion in the ISL's opening matches despite a ban for failing a financial test led to the postponement. Persebaya has also complained that the league's suspension is causing physical and psychological harm to its players. Persebaya and most other clubs are still practicing and conducting test matches to fill the time for the next two weeks. The Indonesian Football Association's Congress in Surabaya on April 18th will elect its chairman and executive committee members. The league's status will also be discussed. Tapi karena harus di stop semangat berkompetisi ini jadi mudah. Kalau secara finansial sendiri, apakah dampak dari penundaan ini apa mas? Ya otomatis kos bertambah karena durasi menjadi lebih.